to my channel karibuni sana asante sana for subscribing this is where we make things happen guys you know what i've been away from my social media pages because um i lost my sister my big sister yeah it's like three weeks now we laid that rest last weekend yeah and may her soul rest in peace you know we say in everything we should learn to tell god thank you in every situation whether it's good whether it's bad like what job said i have lost but i'll always learn how to give thanksgiving to the almighty because he gives and he takes it was a very tough moment for us as a family to come to terms that we have lost one of us being in a big family we are one big family of 14 children we are eight girls and six boys now i cannot say they are girls or boys they are grown up so they are men and women we lost one and it is a very difficult time losing a sister that you have seen growing together. Mtu amekuwa kikorrect, ukifanya makosa. Guys, unaelewa ma sister wa kitambo, si kama ma sister wa ma sister wa squeezy. Those big sisters were tene. They used to correct us. Ukifanya makosa, they used to stand in the gap like your parents. They used to portray the character of your mother when when our parents used to go away for when you were walikuwa naenda kufanya kazi. So, when I cleared my high school, I remember my sister called my father to kwa nyumbani. And he said, and she told my dad that I want Lillian to come to Nairobi because I want to stay with her back in the college because I don't want her to stay at home back there. So my dad released me to come to her. So I was there babysitting her firstborn, that is Brian. And we stayed very well. She was a very good sister, a very quiet one. But they, in Muleva's family, for those who know our family, we are one wild, wild family. When we get to meet each other guys in a kwangani yani uwezi takakutuona but she was a kind of a sister who was very quiet a kind of a sister who was very preserved with her life a very kind of a sister who was such a nice she was a good one i don't know which words i can use to express or say how she was but i don't know how and i don't know how things happen that the good things are the ones that are taken away from us. But all in all, Mungu atabaki. She means what she says. <laughs> and I wouldn't say the name of that person. So, the man was married me today. And my sister liked him. I can remember this one looks like a serious dude. And I can come and as a gender family and be a responsible man for you. So, to catch as a game team, how can be a father in Nini? So, I can do a Now, Lillian, you have your own ID. It's now to be a mature girl. Nataka ukwe na responsibility. Yani ukwe a very responsible girl like how dad and mom wametulea. So nika enda college, nika maliza, nika kuja, aka, eh, hivi, hivi too. So, nika ishi na head. So the man that I'm married today, nili mpata nikua kwa kenshi. Imagine my man used to call my sister, usiku. Aki please can I talk to Lilia? And the good sister she was. Ana anka, hmm? Ana achabwanake amelala. Haezi takata bwanake ajui yo story. Jwasi yone, eh? 
una unafanya una sister yako vitu gani na nakuja na niambia hey no what uko na call hapa na because haki kusumbuliwa lala na isim eh, yani she was a dali ara si doing express aje man semeaje but um, those are some of the good things we can we can recollect from her ju kama si eh single age ona na na mtu na kama angemkataa leo si kwa ni leka na because i'm telling you my sister kitambo alikuwa anga watak sana but i thank god because of the good life that we stayed with her na tunashukuru sana na after we buried her that day i remember there was one our, there is one elder sister sasa ule mkubwa kabisa anaitwa mama masi she said like job alipoteza but he still praised god even in the difficult situation so we sang a very good song as a family to make our hearts Uh, to soothe our hearts so we had gone through a very difficult time we had to sing a song to release her to internal peace listen to this clip <laughs> So thank you for those people who came through to to see and lay our sister off for those who contributed generously to see our sister being laid to rest may God bless you so much that is a little I can say about her that is I don't want to talk because nikianza nitaandika kitabu kubwa sana kumbusa just wanted to say something about her because yeah she is my blood sister God rest her soul in eternal peace and you know what guys 2020 has been a very tough year for everyone it has been a pandemic year people have lost their jobs people have lost their clothes people people have lost things that they value one thing that i have learned is the value of life is god given and we should always appreciate every second that god has given us and as we pray and cross the year 2020 thank you for my viewers my subscribers those who keep on watching me thank you so much and as we watch and as we walk away from 2020 to 2021 naombea baraka may god of heavens open all your doors and as the way he blessed job double times may you open your doors in double portions may god bless you till next time bye bye